Hi there, this is Teresa. Welcome back to the channel. We are gonna take a look and see who is thinking about you and why are they thinking about you. Keep in mind, it is a general collective reading. Only take what resonates, leave the rest. Feel free to check out your sun, moon, or rising placements. I will put the timestamps down below. If you'd like your own personal reading, my email address or my website, timelessdivinetarot.com is listed down below. I do have a 24 to 48 turnaround time on those personal readings. Okay, let's go ahead and get started with Aries first. Let's get a couple letters. I will say any names. Um, these could be letters in their name. It could be their name. It could be your name. Take what resonates. Aries. U-Y-B. Brandy. Bobby. M. Z. C. Michael. Floyd. Fred. So this could be somebody who is a friend. Mo. Maverick, Devin. Okay, Aries, who is thinking about you? Okay, so we have the High Priestess. This is somebody who's really smart and intelligent. Somebody who's also very wise. Page of Wands, it's somebody who's feeling inspired to send you a message. And why? Ace of Cups, because they wanna express their feelings and emotions for you. This is somebody who secretly has been feeling pressured within themselves to actually speak up and tell you that they have a crush on you, that they like you and they are thinking a lot about you. Your nose could be itching a lot when they're thinking about you. I'm hearing Alan and Allison. So they do wanna reach out to you and express these feelings and emotions, Aries. Taurus. 147. Okay, Taurus, who's thinking about you and why? Let's get some letters. Y, X, E, so it could be one of your X's, S, Baron, L, M, Mary, Stephanie, Lisa, Liz, Riley, Barrett, Ariel, Maureen, okay, 10 of cups. So this is definitely an ex of yours. It could be somebody you have children with, Taurus. They are feeling defeated. This is somebody that maybe you were divorced with this person, you were with them for a long time. They have a lot of extra burden and responsibilities. Why are they thinking about you? The Emperor, okay, this is definitely somebody you have children with. They feel that the two of you are divine counterparts, that you are the parents to your child or children. You could have children, two children with this person. This person wants to have a conversation with you. They are thinking about higher level of commitment. They are potentially thinking about reconciliation. They're thinking a lot about the past with that Hierophant there. And there is a lot of defeated energy, and that's what they wanna to talk to you about. They wanna let you know how they've been feeling since the two of you have separated or you have divorced, and the potential of if the two of you were to come back together. Yeah, it does look like they're thinking about the time that was already invested, and they don't wanna waste the time. They're thinking about reconciliation. Gemini. 325. Okay, Gemini, let's see who is thinking about you and why. Let's get some letters. R, D, Rudy, Randy, Y, A, Andy, S, Sam, A, Sosa, Lisa, Lorraine, Dean, Dougie, Daryl. Okay, Gemini, who's thinking about you? Ace of Pentacles, could be an earth sign. Three of Swords and the Fool. Okay, Gemini, this is somebody that you thought you were gonna have an opportunity with this person, but they put you in a third party situation and maybe you decided to cut them out. You decided to leave. Your intuition told you it was not a good idea. This person's thinking about you because they wanna come back to you. They're thinking about how smart and how attractive you are and how they really messed up. And now they're thinking about how they could actually come towards you. They don't wanna breadcrumb you anymore. We got that six of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. They wanna to give to this connection again. They And you could feel intuitively that this person is about to reach out to you. Cancer. 440. Okay, Cancer, who is thinking about you and why? Let's get some letters and names. E, S, Earl, Sam, Arlene, N, Y, Nancy, Nana, Y, V, W, Vanessa, 
Victoria, Veronica, Lyle, Lynetta. All right, Cancer, who is thinking about you? Randolph, Page of Cups. This person could have a fish tattoo. Seven of Wands and the Hierophant. Cancer, this is somebody from the past that wants to communicate with you. They pushed you away. You wanted a commitment and they didn't. This is somebody who is thinking a lot about you because they want to communicate with you that they want to apologize, that they pushed you away, that they were not in the best place in their life. They weren't in a position to be able to have a higher level of commitment. And that's why they're thinking about you. They feel a lot of stress and anxiety, especially if they just up and stop talking to you abruptly and you never knew why. That's why this person's having a lot of anxiety and they're feeling triggered to apologize to you. Leo. 601. Okay, Leo, who's thinking about you and why? A, Z, Alan, Zaina, U, K, Kenneth, P, Paul, Pete, O, Oliver, Ollie, Tiffany, Trudell, Kanita, Okay, Leah, who is this person thinking about you? Tony, Page of Cups, Temperance, could be a Sagittarius, Judgment, Libra Energy. Okay, Leo, this is somebody who needs to apologize to you. This is somebody you had a major tower moment with. We got that tower hidden at the bottom of the deck. This is somebody who knows that they owe you an apology. They want to heal things. They want to make things right. They want to make the choice and the decision to try to apologize and see if they can fix things that they've broken. Kenyatta is what I'm hearing. So that's who's thinking about you is because they messed up. This major tower moment, this person hasn't been able to overcome. Virgo. Seven seventeen. Okay, Virgo, who's thinking about you and why? You, J, Jacob, Jamie, Linda, F, E, L, Felicia, I, Sammy, Winona, J, R, Virgo, who's thinking about you and why? Lydia. Who's thinking about Virgo? Four of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, and Page of Pentacles. This could be an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Yeah, and then we got that Six of Pentacles. This is somebody from your past, Virgo. This could be a soulmate. This is somebody that you've known for a very long time. You had a really strong bond with this person. You could have known this person since you were a child. Maybe you talked about having children with this person. They had held back from you for a very long time. So this is somebody you haven't spoken to in quite some time. They are wanting to reach out to you because they want to do the right thing. They want to balance things out. They want to say the right thing. And they want to communicate about the potential of the two of you having an opportunity. Libra, 837. Okay, Libra, who's thinking about you and why? O, L, Olivia, O, Joy, Y, X, R, Brian, Teddy, Abby, Lola, Renee, Oscar, who's thinking about Libra and why? Three of Swords, Justice, could be another Libra. Two of Wands, this is somebody who does live at a distance, could be somebody that you met online. This is somebody who puts you in a third party situation. Maybe they told you they were being exclusive with you, but that was not true, and you found out what the truth is, and this person now knows that they're busted, that, that you have found out the truth somehow and they're blindsided by it. That's why they're thinking about you. They're thinking, how could this person possibly find out I was talking to someone else? How? If we live at a distance, they, they're not around me physically. How did they know? That's why they're thinking about you. They're trying to figure out how and why did you find out? Because they thought that they were covering it up really well. Scorpio. 955. 
Okay, Scorpio, who's thinking about you and why? T, R, Terry, Tommy, Teresa, Sam, Y, J, Jared, Jet, O, Alan, Al, Lala, Stephanie, Susan, Suzette, Joe or Joey, Lyle, Jesus, Scorpio, who's thinking about you and why? Juan, Ace of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, Seven of Cups. Okay, Scorpio, this is somebody that wants to communicate. We've got that Page of Pentacles. They want to send you a message. This is somebody who... They could have water in their chart or they could have earth in their chart. They are thinking about long-term potential with you. The potential of the two of you coming together, potentially having children, having a home together, having a family together. This is somebody who has a lot of overwhelming feelings and emotions and they fantasize a lot about you, but they're ready to take action with that page of pentacles. That's something that they truly do desire. Sagittarius, 1113. Okay, Sagittarius, who is thinking about you and why? Sagittarius, let's get some letters and some names. V E, Victor, Veronica, U E D, Dean, I, Eileen, Ed, David, Donnie, Reese, Victoria, Yuri. Who is thinking about Sagittarius and why? Dina, Sally, Temperance, it could be another Sagittarius, Hermit, Virgo Energy, and Cancer Chariot Energy. This could be somebody online. We also have Wheel of Fortune. All major arcanists. This is significant, Sagittarius. This is somebody from your past that wants to heal things. Someone who's been seeking what the inner truth is about the connection between the two of you. They want to come towards you because they feel like it's fate. They feel like it's destiny. They've learned something about the connection. They no longer want to hide or be sneaky about it. And they want to be transparent with you about how they feel. Capricorn. 1227. Okay, Capricorn, who's thinking about you and why? E, R, Erica, Aaron, V, T, O, A, Tony, Toya, Ryan, Elijah, Vinny, Amber, Alicia, Okay, Capricorn, who is thinking about you and why? Rory, Six of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles, and the Star. Could be an Aquarius. This is somebody who you work with. Somebody that maybe is hoping that the two of you could come back together. You could have had a fight with this person. Yeah, we've got that Five of Cups um, coming out again. So you could have had a conflict with a coworker who's thinking about what happened. They want to heal things. They want to do the right thing. They maybe want to apologize. They want to fix things. This could be somebody that, you know, wasn't treating you fairly at work. They weren't balancing things out. But now they know that and they don't want to do that no more. They're disappointed in their behavior and their actions. Aquarius. 1340. Okay, Aquarius, who is thinking about you and why? Let's get some letters and some names. A, O, L, G, Gary, O, N, Gina, Nancy, Nettie, Omar, Eloise, Lovey, okay, so we've got the Seven of Wands, the Temperance, could be a Sagittarius, Four of Wands, okay. Aquarius, this is somebody who pushed you away before the world. This is somebody who could live at a distance from you. They pushed away commitment. They pushed away something long-term. They maybe felt like they weren't ready. They weren't responsible enough. They weren't mature enough. There's been some time between the two of you. Now they're ready. They're ready to try to come back and fix things. They're ready to heal things and pour back into this connection. They're hoping you're going to forgive them because their intentions is they want to marry you. Pisces. 1451. Okay, Pisces, who's thinking about you and why? 
U N A T L E. Telly Tennille. Lucille, Louise, Louisa, Lester, Leonard, Nori, Tate, Six of Swords, Justice could be Libra Energy, Page of Swords. This is somebody who's watching you, Pisces. Somebody that moved away from you. This could be somebody you have a child with. The Empress is coming up, being hidden at the bottom of the deck. So if you have a child with somebody and you haven't spoken to this person in a while, this person is watching you online. Why are they watching you? Okay, Eight of Pentacles. They're focused on seeing if you're working, trying to understand what you're up to. They're very focused on you. They're very observant, trying to know more about what you're up to. Do you have other children? Especially if this is somebody that you had a child with and you have no contact with the child or the mother of this child. Um, this is somebody who is doing a little bit of stalking, trying to investigate more about you. 